The Bloodline suffered a huge setback at Survivor Series, War Games as they lost the men's War Games match against Roman Reigns and the OG Bloodline. While Solo Sikoa still holds his position as the tribal chief, the faction's credibility has taken a massive hit. Therefore, Triple H could be forced to introduce a 33-year-old star as the new member of the stable. The star in question is none other than Haiku Leo. He reportedly signed with WWE last month, and the company has plans for him to make his debut on NXT. The former NJPW star is believed to be honing his skills before joining the developmental brand. However, with Tongaloa sidelined indefinitely due to injury, a spot has opened up in the bloodline. As a result, Triple H may be compelled to fast track Hikulio's debut on the main roster instead of NXT, adding him directly into the bloodline. With Loa's injury undermining the credibility of Solo Sikoa's bloodline, WWE could see the need to bolster the faction. To restore its dominance and establish it as a legitimate threat, a giant like Hikulio could be the perfect addition to the faction. Moreover, Hikulia's strength and imposing stature could serve as a game changer for Sikoa's faction, which appeared weakened against the OG bloodline at Survivor Series, War Games. With the faction's momentum faltering in recent weeks, the chances of Triple H preponing the 33 year old debut as part of the bloodline are increasingly high. While the possibility is intriguing, it will be interesting to see how Triple H will plan the route for Sikoa and his group moving forward in WWE. The bloodline seems to be frustrated with the fact that they were unsuccessful in beating the alliance of the OG bloodline and CM Punk at Survivor Series. Fueled with anger, Solo Sikoa could be looking for an opportunity to seek revenge on Roman Reigns and his faction. Therefore, there is a good possibility that the street champion could turn to Hikulio's help to dismantle the OG bloodline. The self proclaimed tribal chief could enlist the 33 year old giant to orchestrate a sneaky attack on Roman Reigns. Hikulio could unleash a series of brutal maneuvers to destroy the OTC, while Sikoa, Jacob Fatu, and Tama Tonga could decimate the other members of the OG bloodline. Together, they could deliver a devastating blow reasserting their dominance on SmackDown. Moreover, if this scenario unfolds, it could serve as the perfect stage for the debut of the former NJPW star. With potential victims like Reigns and the Usos, the 33-year-old star would quickly establish his position on the roster. Additionally, this move would set the stage for another explosive showdown between the two factions offering a chance to finally settle the civil war. It is an interesting possibility that could change the direction of the Bloodline saga in the future. Nonetheless, it will be captivating to see how Solo Sikoa plans to reassert his dominance on SmackDown in the weeks to come.